among this year's matriculated students at the American University of Nigeria. Our 13 rescued Chibok school schoolgirls. They were offered scholarships to pursue degree education at the institution. The Chibok girls joined other new students from Rwanda, Niger Republic, Cameroon and Nigeria at the matriculation ceremony for the 2022 academic session and pledge ceremony. Last October, 57 Chibok students from AUN's New Air School, NFS, were admitted into AUN's undergraduate programs. They are a part of our community. We don't treat them separately. They are now enrolled undergraduate students. There's a very large group behind me. Our new foundation students have matriculated in to the university and they're doing really well. I had them in class last semester. I just said to them, I couldn't be prouder of them because they show that education conquers everything. They're here, you're surrounded by them, but they're university students now not Chibok students. This was the matriculation ceremony of American students of Nigeria for the 2022 academic session. Former Vice President Atiku Abubakar, the founder of the institution, fully participated in the ceremony. The president of the American University of Nigeria, Dr. Magi and Singh, said the institution would also be seeking the approval of the National Universities Commission to run degree and postgraduate programs in the fields of medicine and public health. She explained that a request by this institution to run programs in public health, including medicine, was in part due to the importance of public health in educating people in a pandemic era. We are committed this semester to applying and we hope very much to have approval for public health, both at the undergraduate and the graduate level. Um, it's easy to see why that's so important. We've always wanted to do public health, but the pandemic has spurred us on because public health is about educating people to prevent diseases. At this moment, when we're still in the pandemic, maybe less, less severe in Nigeria, but my country and Europe and many parts of the world are still affected by this. And we always must remember we're not out of it yet. Just because Nigeria has not experienced what my country has does not mean, unfortunately, that this virus has run, run its course. The expectation for AUN is, from AUN is, I want them to, the promise they have made, they should keep. Though I'm already seeing it from my daughter, 300 level, she's very perfect in everything she comes home the way i took her to school that's the way she came back and even more better than where, where, the way she went first of all nigeria i think it's a very welcoming country opposite uh, of what the whole world might think i think it was very welcoming to me and uh, i'm very happy to be here however more still needs to be done to secure school children around the country hello Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.